Hey, I'm Matt. And, um, pre-tornado stuff. I actually don't need those. You know, pre-tornado weather. It's kind of calm here. Don't really feel any wind where I'm at. But if you look at the treetops, they're slightly moving. You look at the treetops, they're moving. So there's wind a little up a little higher but um it's very humid and it's in the 70s which is not good with the storms we have rolling in because the updrafts that warm updraft air will fuel tornadoes and only make it worse so um yeah this has me a little worried um later tonight let me see what time it is not that oh well later tonight see there's some wind coming through it's starting to get windier out in front of the storms out in front of the storm is starting to get windier. Uh, we're under a tornado warning. Or no, excuse me, tornado watch, flood watch, and severe thunderstorm watch. And they said we're going to get softball size hell. So, yeah. Sounds like a bunch of different stuff. But, um... I don't know if you can hear it, but the wind is starting to pick up. And it, it's, I don't know. I'm concerned. And I'm not sure that we're all going to fit in our hall closet. I might have to do something. My number one priority is ensuring that my wife and son that they're safe. But, um, yeah, we have a uh, starting to feel a little bit of moisture. And we are, the, the weather pattern looks for massive tornadoes later in the evening to head up through central Oklahoma, which I'm almost dead center in Oklahoma. I'm in Norman. Oklahoma City is dead center, and I'm 15, 20 miles away, you know. I mean, I work in uh, let's see, slightly, very slightly south uh, west of downtown Oklahoma City, and it takes, it's about uh, 23 miles from my house. So, yeah, uh, this is not looking good. You can see these dark clouds up above me, and this is only the tip of the iceberg. So, yeah, I'll keep y'all informed.